Lisa here, come on today with my Korea Times 130th release. And I'm just going to jump right in. So starting out, we have the pretty scallop tall tag guys. And this is such a cute set. I love tags. <laughs> if you know me, I love tags. Anyways, this is so cute. And then this also goes with one of her previous releases, tall tag frame die layers. And if you have the one with the stitching, that will go perfectly with this. And then for the Ginger Easter 2, this is the set that goes with the Ginger Person dies. Simple to put together. My Creative Time uh, shows that on her um, on one of her her uh, sneaky peek days so uh, just check that out I have her link down below so make sure you go over and check that out and see how to put that and together. then we also have the ginger Easter one set which goes with the boy and girl gingers and that is adorable as well fits just perfectly and it's just so cute I mean who doesn't like bunnies right here we have the ginger Easter bunnies stamps and then of course those are accompanied with the dies and you can check that out right there just screenshot there goes the dies right here love 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 them both and of course her die sets always cut out some form of her paper packs that she puts together and so let's show you that in that paper pack you're going to use this one this and this and that's the easter basket there so let's just show you that paper real quick like there it goes back side of this has the script and um, I'm starting from the back side so that'll go with that script there we go just really cute set and it starts back over so that's how that set looks there and then um, the name of that set was uh, Spring Gingers. And then this one is Dots, Flowers, and Solids. And it uh, goes with that Spring Ginger set. Really cute set. And as you see, I've been cutting it in, into it already. All right. And so that's those six by six papers for this release. Let's jump in and show you what I have created, and then I'll show you all of the extra products that I used at the end. So this was day one, sneaky peek. This is what I made. Hopefully you like what you see there. And of course, this came from the Ginger Easter Bunnies stamp and die set, and I put it on the uh, fancy treat box. Super cute. Here goes the Ginger Bunny bows that I made. And I use her medium ginger bow dye for that and add it some a little gem on the back side of those. That was also for the sneaky peek on day two, if I'm not mistaken. And then this is the other one that I had for the sneaky peek day two. And I made um, a peeker die using the uh, snowfall snowball um, dies. And I like how that turned out. So I used the snowball for the face, for the body, and for the hands. You can use the palm of the feet um, for the hands as well. But just take in mind, if you do something like this, it might cover up your sentiment. So that's why I use the snowball. And you can also use that little uh, part right there from the foot um, for the nose if you prefer. But I use a, a ginger cheek for the nose, as well as the eyes from the ginger. And there goes the torn uh, paper frame dies. And then the XOXO border frame. This one came from the tall frame dies. All right. And then there goes the inside. And I used that spring ginger paper. And in the background here, I used the uh, clouds, slopes, and snowball um, stencil. So I just made some clouds from that. And then for the last day of sneaky peeks, I used this here. I used the pretty scallop tall tag dies, and I also used the tall tag frame die layers in the inside. This is the, from the um, Easter Ginger Bunnies stamp and die set. I just didn't put the face on, and I made it as if he's walking away. So you see his little bunny butt there, 
And then I also use um, the stamps and colored in the hearts that are on there. So, so cute. All right, let me show you everything that I use to create everything. So we have the tall tag frame die layers. We have the torn paper frame die layers. I use that one right there. Right, cloud slopes and snowflakes. I use um, actually just the clouds. The tall frame dies. I use this right here um, for this layer here and as well as the uh, handle for um, the basket there or the treat, the treat bag. And then this here, this is the fancy treat box is what I use that for. There goes that. The snowballs, I use this, this, and that little small one there. Medium ginger is what I use, which I use both of those. And the XO, XO border frame, I use that right here. Girl and boy ginger, that's where I got that cheek from. Uh, sweet ginger person, that's where I got the eyes from. All right, so those are my creations for this week. Make sure you head over to My Creative Time and check out her um, her sale that she has going on. Everything that you need for the sale will be linked down below. So make sure you grab that discount code and go get your Easter goodies. All right, all the links to my design team sisters will be down below as well. That is all I have for you. Thanks so much, everyone. You have a blessed and crafty day.